What's going on everybody? Math with Chris and we are going to find some factors of 36, not some factors, all the factors. 36 is a bit of a tough one, heads up. There are a bunch of factors on this one, so it's going to take some steps. Uh, first thing we always do is bank the easiest two factors. That's of course 1 and the number itself, 36. All right, now we got to uh, branch out 36, start the factor tree. Uh, any two numbers we can think of to multiply together to give us 36? Actually, quite a few options here. Let's go with uh, 3 times 12. Again, you could, you could go with anything that works, but 3 times 12 works. 3 is a prime number, so we can circle that. 3 is done. 12, of course, is not. We can break down 12 a bit further. Uh, we can break down 12 into, let's go with 3 times 4. Uh, 3 is a prime number, circle it. 4, however, is not. 4 can be broken down even further. 4 is, of course, 2 times 2. And 2's are prime numbers, so we can circle those guys right there. They're finished. And as you can see, if we go down the tree, any branch we go down, we always land at a circled prime number, uh, meaning we are done with the tree. And you can see we got a 2, a 2, a 3, and a 3. Two twos and two threes, so two times two times three times three. Those are the prime factors of 36. Multiplies those together, you get 36. Uh, that checks out. Uh, so now we bank the prime factors we got. We got a we got a two, and we got a three. Uh, and what else can we bank? Well, we can bank anything we hit along the way. We can hit we we, we hit a 12, and we hit a four. So both of those get banked. 12, four. Uh, and now the last step, we have to come down here and see if there's any combination of these numbers we can multiply together to give us a new number uh, that hasn't been banked yet. Well, let's try 2 times 2. We already got 4. What about 2 times 3? 2 times 3 is 6. We don't have that yet. So let's bank a 6. Uh, anything else? How about 3 times 3? Well, 3 times 3 is 9. We don't have that yet. Let's bank a 9. Uh, what about 2 times 2 times 3? 2 times 2 times 3 would give us 12. We already got that. What about 2 times 3 times 3? 2 times 3 times 3 would be 18. That one's missing. Nice try, 18. Almost got away, but we got you. 18 gets banked. That is now finished. There's no other combination of these prime numbers we can multiply to give us a new number. So these are our factors of 36. In order, they are 1, 2, 3, 4, 6, 9, 12, 18, and 36. That is complete. So that's uh, the factors of 36. Hope you guys found that helpful. If you'd like to see another example of finding factors using factor trees, check the video in the upper left corner. Until next time, guys, have a great day.